Okay, hello. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. That is JB Graphics. Okay. So, in today's tutorials, we're going to learn how to create custom shapes. If you say custom shapes, because we're using a smartphone, there are some shapes that you will not find in the Pixel app, but we can create them ourselves. So, we move. As usual, I will pick my background color, which is white. Now you go to shapes, then you select. Yeah, if I'm going too fast and you are not familiar with the uh, tools in Pixel Lab, go and watch the tutorial on introduction to tools to Pixel Lab part one, and then introduction to the tools in Pixel Lab part two, so that you'll be familiar with the tools. Okay. Then I, and whenever you watch any tutorial. You not find yourself wanting so i choose red then you not click on your check mark you increase the radius to let me say 30 is okay so let's see okay so i choose red you can see that the edges are having some round shapes okay now with these round shapes i want two of the edges to have the round shape and two not to hurt to have the, to have it so this is it i position it in the middle using the relative position then i select another shape which is a square or rectangle can also do it then I choose a color for it. Let's say blue. Then I position it here. Okay. So you have to zoom your work. You see? By clicking on the plus icon over here. And zoom it. Now you let the blue go back. Go to back. Then you move it's by one pixel so that it will be so you see the blue i'm using the square to cover one side of the rounded shape so let's see if it's okay okay it's cool now let me push it down and then to the right by one pixel okay so it's cool now so you can see that this part here one of the rounded edge have been covered so i copy the blue shape again copy click on copy then i bring it to the down here that is my right corner then you send it to back you play around it by moving the shape to cover the rounded edge okay. mm -hmm. so you can see now i've covered the bottom side that is the right side now i have a square shape with two rounded edges and two square edges so now i've created my first what custom shape but you can't just leave it like that so you would have to merge them so you click on the layer tool then you click on the boxes to merge them after merging you have to give it a uniform color so that the blue and red will not be seen so you go to color click on color you give it a color so i think i want it to be in red so this is my first custom shape we're going to create another one so you can see that this square has two uh, rounded edges and then 
two as in a fix or a square hot edge. Now my second one will be let me check. Okay, I'm going to create a second custom shape. Let's see. So I select a shape, I give it a color. Let's say blue. With this one, I'm going to cover only the top part. Okay, only the top part. So I increase the radius to let's say 35. It's okay. So I'll select another shape that is a square shape, give it a color let's see any color so that you can work on it any color different from the blue so you minimize it now you click on your check mark you send it to back as usual then you move it you zoom your work you see if you don't zoom your work you don't get a perfect one so always when you are working you have to zoom your work and see if everything is intact let me push it to the top a bit okay let me see i think it's cool or right, let me shift it one pixel let's see no okay it's cool now so you can see that i've made one of the rounded edge uh, a square hot in a square shape so i'm going to do same to the right side of the blue rounded edge so i'll copy the green square copy then i place it here to back then i move it i zoom just to have a perfect work Okay. I have to work on it. Shift it to the top a bit. Okay, it's cool now. So you can see that the top rounded edges have been covered. So I now merge them. That is one, two, and a three. You see you have to know the first shape you created so you see i didn't click that one this one this was the first one i created so i clicked on these boxes and then i left this one out so you merge you click on this in the middle here i sure want to make then you merge you give it a color let's choose yellow for it no okay it's cool now. So yellow. Okay. So this is our second custom shape that we've created. Okay. So in creating custom shapes, you just select the shape without clicking on the check mark. So let's create a third custom shape and see how it is. So you click on shape. You see, you don't click on the check mark. You increase the ra radius, then you choose a color for it. So let's choose green. So the radius to 45 is okay. I reduce the size. This time round, I'm go just going to cover one part of the rounded edge. So you click your check mark. Then you select another shape, you give it a color, let's see, mm. Mm. violet, I minimize it, okay, then I send it to back, then I move it, zoom your work, always zoom your work. So, 
this is it let me see yeah, it's cool no let me cover the other side rather yeah, yeah i'm just covering one of the cape edge okay yeah it's cool now so i zoom back and then now i match so i'm going to match the green this green and then the violet you should be you know uh, uh, knowing the colors that you choose for the custom shape creation so you see when i i clicked on the layer tool i just selected these two the green and then the violet you match you give it a color I want the dark green for it so this is it so this is how we create custom shapes so any shape that you want to create you can do that on your own with the help of this tutorial and then I think you have enjoyed the tutorial please don't forget to subscribe if you have not subscribed to this channel like share and leave your comments in the comment section below my whatsapp group link is in the description below materials too are in the description below of some of the tutorials there are tutorials like uh, designing 3d realistic text in pixel app only using only pixel app to design 3d text introduction to pixel art part one and two how to blend pictures to its background you know this tutorial that is how to blend pictures to its background people normally find it difficult check my youtube channel and then check my tutorial videos you will get to find it there okay so please you subscribe 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 click on the notification button too so that you'll be notified whenever i upload tutorials Thank you for watching and God bless you. Okay, see you next time. Bye-bye.